What does the device look like? The device consists of several components. A sampling headset that fits in the palm of your hand and resembles a cell phone. Sanitary, replaceable mouthpieces that are inserted in the top of the handset. A coiled cable that connects the handset to a relay module that is mounted underneath the dash or in the engine compartment. How does it work? The device draws a small portion of your breath sample into a fuel cell sensor. Any alcohol present chemically reacts with the sensor, producing water and electricity, which is precisely measured and translated into an equivalent blood alcohol concentration, or BAC. If the result of your test is below the lockout point, an encrypted signal is sent to the relay to close, which will allow your vehicle to be started. If the test result is too high, then the vehicle's ignition system will remain locked. Where is it installed? The sampling headset is temporarily mounted with Velcro or a phone clip to the vehicle's dash within easy reach of the driver. There is no drilling or permanent connection made into the exposed area of the vehicle dash or operator compartment. After the device is removed, the vehicle's wiring connections are returned to normal. Will it affect the operation of my vehicle? A properly installed device under ordinary use will not drain or damage your battery or the electrical system and its components, nor interfere with the normal operation of your vehicle in any way. When the vehicle is not running, the device draws less current than the clock in your car. Prior to the installation, a qualified technician will inspect both the mechanical and electrical systems of your vehicle to ensure the vehicle, at that time, is capable of supporting the proper function of the interlock device. Once installed, the device regularly monitors and records battery voltage and cranking power. The power light will flash if the device detects the car's battery voltage is low, warning you that your vehicle's electrical system may need repair or your battery needs to be replaced.